Go. <laughs> All the stuff you get away with. Okay. And what is it? Red Hall. Oh. <laughs> it's like. Punch. It's a Boyd. Are we talking about a punchline? <laughs> okay. If you're watching here, you can actually see the line right across there from there to there where the line actually was hit. Probably what happened was he landed on the line and one of his wingtips touched. And of course, since that was the spot next to the line, the wingtips are just basically feather. Feathers probably burnt off and it wasn't an issue, but the legs and the feet got the run of the most electricity and the heat. All right, the good news is this guy can actually feel inside of here and can actually feel these areas, but I'm not 100% sure how conscious that feeling is. Um, like pressure, not pain, or some. Yeah, because when of... I was torquing them back and forth, it, it got to the point where it was really, really bad before we start to do this little twitching thing. The good news is he actually does have part of his innervation, and part of his musculature back on the on the flexors of these three digits up on both feet. The bad news is uh, the flexors on these two digits are not that good. Oh, see, I just touched that one and it went in. Yeah, see, so, sometimes they. So I, we're, we've got some improvement. I just expected more improvement by now. Anyway, here is our buddy. He is uh, beautiful. What's up, dude? Hey. That's a cool What's bird. up? <laughs> There's no sense of being stressed out. We'll get you back in your cage in just a minute. The good news is he's actually habituated well. These guys are able to do quite a bit of physical therapy on him. I'm reluctant to use any corticoids or any anti-inflammatories at this point in time because they've gotten you know such a good improvement. And it's only been a week, so I'm not going to panic. Uh, <laughs> these guys are doing a, a very good job. Isn't that right, Doug? Yes, we are <laughs> doing very good. While I'm at it, we will publicly say that it is Doug's birthday this weekend, isn't it? Well, Tuesday, but we're going to celebrate okay. it on Saturday. Okay, so anyway, if you're in the area <laughs> and you get a chance on Saturday to go out to Wild at Heart, there's going to be karaoke and a bonfire and hell, I, I might even buy you a drink now that I'm going to have a lot to give, but I'll do it my best to make sure that whoever shows up gets a drink. A lot of ridiculousness will yeah. be going on. And it will be ridiculousness. You got that part right. <laughs> um, Doug is probably going to sing his favorite streak song. Yes. And the Legend of Woody Swamp. Yep. And okay. the Edmund Fitzgerald. Oh, okay. That's right. You do that one as well. And I have not decided what I'm going to sing yet. Any requests while you're thinking about it? I will have to think it up really good. <laughs> Remember, I like you. <laughs> yeah, but you're so good. <laughs> I like that one you do. The one with the, that's real fast and then slow and then fast. Oh, okay. Yeah, he's talking about uh, Blood, Sweat, and Tears. Yes. Um, okay, so all right, there's a request here for Blood, Sweat, and Tears. All right, that's it for now. Say goodbye to Hockey Hockey. Bye-bye, Hockey Hockey. Bye-bye. <laughs>